The research skill that college students struggle with most is how to pose a question. I constantly try to teach students that they need to ask questions and that the suspense in writing a good research question, re research paper, comes from the kind of questions you pose and the way in which you go about answering them. You need to um, develop assignments that involve students questioning. That's the most important thing. Students need to know that their questions matter. That if they have doubts about something, if they don't believe something, those, that's what they should be doing when they're doing research. So assignments that make them question and make them provide evidence for the things that they say. Evidence that's valid. If I could give advice to high school teachers on creating research assignments, um, I would really encourage them to teach students how to again how to evaluate resources that they find. Um, so I think like a great way of doing that would be if they find um, a news article and it quotes you know a source or a statistic, have the students find the source of that statistic. Where did it come from? You know who was the researcher on that? What other things has that researcher done? Why is that researcher an expert in the field? And why is it important for um, for them to know about that type of research? And so I think you know just evaluating resources is like it would be a great um, it would be a great you know skill for students to have and to learn in high school. The other. I would say major difficulty is going from an idea, a topic, even a topic of the kind of the right magnitude, into what words should I use to search for that. My students expect a lot of pre-prepared materials for them. I hand out readers and I find it very difficult to get the students to move outside of prescribed reading lists. Um, and simply to delve into a library catalog and to work independently on, in finding sources that work for them. I don't think you can expect high school kids all to necessarily become great researchers, but there's a couple of good principles that would really be helpful for when they get to college. So it would be really great if when students left high school they had an understanding that there are different kinds of information and that those different kinds of information are good for different kinds of things. It's not just college-bound students that need these skills. It's all students because everybody in life is going to have a need for quality information, whether they're using it in an academic sense or whether they're using this information in a personal sense. Uh, if they're looking on the web for medical information, they need to know whether it's valid whether it's something that they can rely on, if they're looking for financial information. So I would say that the kind of skills that students need in college are very much related to what they need in life.